Well, this experiment is about a hot chimney from where hot air comes out and spins a fan. It's called as a convection fan. You need some old cardboard, a candle, some paper, scissors, matchbox and some glue. Take a 5 cm square and fold both the diagonals and the midlines. And then draw the blue lines and cut them with the scissors for making the fan blades. Now you fold the cut portions and press the middle part to make a cone. This cone, this is the view from below and a pin will perch in this. Now this fan can be perched on the tip of a pin and it will rotate quite freely. Take a piece of cardboard, cut it, these are the dimensions and then apply rubber adhesive on all the flaps. See also the rectangular flaps below. These are for the air inlet. After putting rubber glue, we use Fevi Bond. Wait for a little while for the glue to dry up and then assemble this chimney. It's basically a rectangular box with a pyramid perched on top and there's a small hole on the top so that the air can come out and you can see the flaps below these are for the air to get in this is the chimney at the top you can see this white spot now the chimney is all ready apply once again a bit of rubber glue wait for a while for it to dry up and then affix the pin over there the pin point should be straight Perch the fan on top of the pin and the fan should rotate freely. Now put the chimney on top of a lighted candle. You just have to wait for a few seconds, maybe 30 seconds and the hot air being lighter will go up the chimney and then it will whirl the fan round and round. We know that hot air is lighter so it will rise up come out from this little hole in the chimney and this is going to make the fan go round and round. You can also make this chimney from an old CD box and the top of a coke bottle. Here it's very transparent. You can actually see the candle lighted below and as the hot air comes out it rotates the fan on the top. 